All right, this is the bonus question on homework, and ABCD is a trapezoid in which AB equals 16. So go ahead and mark AB equal to 16, and then BC is 10, that's already marked, and the measure of angle BCD is 40, that's already marked. So you can see these two here already have their markings. So the first thing it asks is to find AD. So notice if I want this side length, I also could put another invisible line right here of the same length. So let's go put that in and let's make this called, I don't know, BF. We'll call that point F. And so if I draw that line BF, same as AD, so these two are equal, and I know that there's a 16 on the top of AB, then there's also a 16 on the bottom here of DF. So we've just created a rectangle, right? In order to find this side BF, that means it would be the same as AD. So that's going to solve our letter A. So how could I find BF? You got it, trig. So over here, I'm going to be looking at a reference angle of 40, and I'm going for the opposite. I'm going to call this an X. That's our variable. And I want that length, X. And I've got a hypotenuse. So what uses opposite and hypotenuse? You got it, it's a sine function. So we're gonna say sine of 40 degrees is equal to opposite over hypotenuse. Multiply both sides by 10, and that's what we're gonna plug into the calculator right now. So grab your calculator, do 10 times the sine of 40, and see what you get. Grabbing my calculator, 10 times the sine of 40, 6.43, and this is in feet. That's what that little tiny apostrophe mark means. That means feet, in case you didn't know. Okay, so we found one thing right now where this length is 6.43, and that was my answer for A. So let's see what it wants next. Next, it wants CD, which is this whole length. So I've already got the 16, I'm just missing this little part, FC. So guess what? I could use trig again to find this bottom side. I'm going to call it Y. So I would be doing the adjacent over the hypotenuse this time, and that's a cosine. So cosine of 40 is equal to the adjacent, oops, sorry, we called it a Y, over the hypotenuse, which is still 10, and then multiply by 10 to both sides, and this is what you're going to be plugging into your calculator, 10 times the cosine of 40, and see what you get. Please take a minute to try that. Did you get 7.66 feet? So that's this little side length here that we needed. So this whole length CD is 16 plus 7.66, so let's add that and that gives me 23.66 for that whole bottom length CD. Okay, find the area of ABCD. So I don't know if you remember this. I don't know when was the last time you did area of a trapezoid, but it goes like this. One half of base one plus base two times height. So now we have all these pieces of information. Base one is either the top or the bottom, it doesn't matter, we'll call the top 16. Base two is the whole bottom, 23.66, times the height of 6.43. So take a calculator, go si uh, <clears throat> 16 plus 23.66, times 6.43 divided by two and I'm getting 127.51. Since we're rounding, make that an approximation. Feet, 127.51. How'd you do?